Hello, my name is Agathis and I'm online and this is the first episode in my playthrough of Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition. In the last episode we created our character so we are about to venture forth and watch the intro video. Nestled atop the cliffs that rise from the Sword Coast, the Citadel of Candlekeep houses the finest and most comprehensive collection of writings on the face of Farron. It is an imposing fortress, kept in strict isolation from the intrigues that occasionally plague the rest of the Forgotten Realms. It is secluded, highly regimented, and it is home. Within these hallowed halls of knowledge, your story begins. You have spent most of your twenty years of life within this keep's austere walls, under the tutelage of the sage Gorion. Acting as your father, he has raised you on a thousand tales of heroes and monsters lovers and infidels, battles and tragedies. However, one story was always left untold, that of your true heritage. You have been told that you are an orphan, but your past is largely unknown. Lately, oh. Gorion has been growing distant from you, as if some grave matter weighs heavily on his heart. You have asked about his concerns as gently as possible, but your queries have been in vain. Your sole comfort is the knowledge that he is a wise man, and you know he will tell you when the time is right. Nonetheless, his silence is troubling, and you cannot help but feel that something is terribly wrong. Today, Gorion has appeared more agitated than ever, and now he has uncharacteristically interrupted your chores in the middle of the day. Imparting hurried instructions for you to equip yourself for travel, he has handed you what gold he can spare, but given no clue as to why. Nevertheless, you now stand before the Candlekeep Inn, ready to purchase what you need for an unplanned and unexpected journey. All right, there we go. That is our introduction. And here we are. We have got 120 gold from Gorion. That's nice. We start equipped with a quarter staff. Yes. And not much else, to be honest. Now, I need to decide what kind of zoom level I'm going to use for most of the game. Um, somewhere around here feels about right. I really love how crisp this looks with the new Enhanced Edition. It's really smooth. They've really made the graphics pop. Uh, compared to where they were. Um, so yeah, here's our character. This was created in the other video. Um, we have an arm class of 10 and we get minus one because of our dexterity of 15. Um, uh, to hit modifier is um, 20 and we get minus two because um, we are strong. We have plus two because we were using a weapon that we're not very good at. Uh, the quarter staff. So we'll have to see how that goes. We only have ten hit points, uh, but we get a boost to our damage because of our high strength. Because we're a super, super strong warrior. Really, I, I really hate having to have a high strength as a warrior. Um, as a fighter in this game. You can't be just a dexterous warrior. You've really got to be a strong... I mean, 18 strength is something like 1 in 100,000 or something. Um, which is pretty annoying. But we are intelligent and we're very charismatic. And that's... We're going to use, be using our brains and our... and our uh, wits to get by. Think carefully. So let's go inside here. Um, what have we got? We've got these tutors. We can talk yes. to all the tutors. Hello, child. Shall we continue your lessons? Uh, I will tag the tutors on the way through. I won't be listening to Hello, any of their lessons. Child. Shall um, we continue your lessons? They are just there if you've never played this game before. They'll tell you about how to pick up items and things like that. Um, unfortunately, there's a locked chest here. So we can't do much with that. I don't even think... Oh, we can bash it open. Cool. Get some gold. And a couple of scrolls. There we go. We can't lockpick because we're not a thief or a warrior. Let's say hello to Winthrop. 
My hotel's as clean as an elven arse. Well, hello there, young one. Come to visit your old pal Winthrop, have ye? Well, don't forget the 10,000 gold piece entrance fee as Burkhannel keeps custom, don't you know? Uh, you always were a big kid of Winthrop. That gets funnier very nearly every time I hear it. Well, perhaps not quite so often. Oh, I'm just having a bit of fun with ye, my friend. Them monks might be walking about with poles in their nethers, but you know you are always welcome here in my sight. Oriented well by you, we did. So, is there anything that I can do for you? Some drinks, some room to sleep, or anything to buy? Uh, we can have a look at what he's got for sale. We've got rooms here. Uh, we've got stuff to buy, and we might buy something soon. It's a shame we can't sell the scrolls, and we can ask for some uh, rumours and things here. Um, let's think. Um, firstly, a helmet isn't a bad thing to start with. Um, I'm not sure about armour, I've got to admit. Um, we don't have a huge amount of gold. Um, I might just get some studded leather for now. Um, I would like to buy uh, a halberd. A halberd is our primary weapon, along with longbow. And that's a bit too expensive for us. Let me get, and uh, let me get some. I need to get some bolts. Yeah, I, yes, I'm meta gaming a tiny bit, but. That's okay. We'll wear the studded leather armor. Uh, okay, that gives us an armor class of six, which is better than what we had. We'll put a helmet on. That's that's going to protect us against critical hits, which is handy. And instead of this quarter staff, we're going to have a halberd. So now our two hit armor class. Our two hit armor class zero, or Thakro, is now 20. Uh, so it's now 19 rather than 20, which is much better than 20. That's good. Um, we can talk to Firebeard over here, Firebeard Elven Hair. It's so hard to find decent folk nowadays. Ah, yes, I'm back within the hallowed halls of Candlekeep. With this iron crisis upon, it, crisis upon us, the trip from Beragos was more hazardous than I care to relate. So, some foreboding there, something about an iron crisis, and he's come from Beragos. You're Garion's ward, aren't you? Ma, you have come into your own. If you would permit an old man jealous of youth to say so. Hmm. I left an identify scroll with Teth Torah in the era grounds. He should be done examining it by now, so if you could fetch it for me, I'd be grateful. So we've got a quest to get the scroll from Firebeard. Uh, we've got some nobles in here. Uh, we can nick this dagger off the wall there. Let's talk to the young lady. A pleasure to meet a socially acceptable person such as yourself. I'd much prefer it if you leave me be. Okay. No time to chit chat. Stare up to the heat, young one. You will need a good fire to warm the chill stairs of those monks. Most inhospitable they are. Isn't that so, lovey? Oh, yes, darling. They are most standoffish. Um, let's see. Let's, um... Um... Well, they lead a somewhat cloistered life here. They're unaccustomed to many visitors. You are perhaps a bit colourful compared to what they're used to. Colourful, dear. Perhaps we should dress a little more plainly to fit in. It's worth a try, my dear, although our clothes may only be the half of it. They certainly couldn't react any worse than they have. I thank you for your suggestion, Agatis. I'm putting it tactfully. Good eve to you. Now, there are... Uh, I'm going to play this pretty straight. There is an option there where you can um, find a way to steal some jewellery from these guys. Uh, I think it really only works if you're a thief. Uh, but I'm not going to be... Think carefully. Uh, ...metagaming this too much. Uh, we're in the upper floor of the inn. We can have a look around. 
few gold coins here. Um, we, can we bash this in? Yeah. A necklace. Okay. How about this one? Some gold and a potion. This one. We failed to force it. I don't think this is going to work now. No, we're not quite strong enough. We open that lock, unfortunately. That's a pity. How about you? Don't Who are you? Don't touch me. I might catch something. Yes, might I help you? Um, I was just wondering who else was sharing the inn with me tonight. Who might you be? I might may very well be anyone, but I am Christian of Waterdeep. Likely you would not know my family name or history, and this suits me well and good. These trips to Candle Keep are a bit of an extravagance on my part, and uh, whilst I neither use illicit substances nor consort with hired company, I spend quite enough here that I should not like it common knowledge. To this end, I should appreciate it if you would forego your little odd attempt at inductor introductions and leave me to my thoughts. Alright. We're not welcome there. And how about you? Are you an special? Quincy. Away with you, beggar! What? I certainly hope there's an explanation for this intrusion. Explain yourself! Um... I might have, uh, just getting to know the neighbours, who might you be? My name is Quincy. Beyond that, it's my own business and none of your concern. Leave, lest I report this intrusion to the guard. Okay, we don't want to mess around with him. Let's move on. With caution. So I don't think there's anything else to do here. We've got our bits and pieces for now. So let's think see what else carefully. we've got. We've got a guard. Can we say hello? Apparently we cannot. He's running too quickly. This is the candle keep in. More tutors to talk to. Hello, child. Not really interested. Shall we continue your lessons? Who are you? Lydia. Hide away that which should not see the sun's light. Okay. Oh, hello. Have you seen my copy of the History of Halrua anywhere? You know how I can't stand the constant shuffling of arthritic feet up in the library, so I thought I'd get a bit of fresh air just east of here and... Oh, I hate being so absent-minded. Please, if you could find it, I really do need it back. Okay, so we got another quest to find Flidia's book. We have another tutor. Hello, child. Okay, no Shall thank you. Shall we continue your lessons? Cows. Another tutor. Hello, child. Thank you. Shall we That's continue about leveling up. Your lessons? Who are you? Another tutor. Hello, child. Fatigue, morale, disease, poison, and lessons? so on. This is the priest quarters. Let's check out the priest quarters, shall we? Hello. Hello. Who are you? Oh, goody, goody. I've gone and found ye first. You are the ward of Gryon, no doubt. Not really sure what accent I'm doing there. I am. What can I do for you? Oh, our encounter could be, shall be quite simple for you. Plainly put, I have made it my mission to end your life. Success will mean a little respect among my peers. So you see, you can do very little, except die. Okay, so we're paused. We have an enemy sighted. So let's have at him. I'll crush your face, I will. Make you dead and done. Ooh, wow, that's dead. 20 experience. Okay, he's left me yes. a dagger. Thanks very much. Got a chest. Can we bash that open. Yep. Another dagger. The barrel. It's empty. A desk. Uh, some gold coins. And a couple of boxes over here. With what's that? A warhammer. And we're done. All right. A little bit of minor loot. Who are these guys? Hmm? Harder. 
Agathis, you cut yourself above the brow there. Classic hero injury from any movie. Just above the brow, just so you can have a little blood trickle down but not actually hurt you. What is wrong, child? Something in your eyes tells me that something is very wrong indeed. Um, oh, we don't want to... Let's keep this fairly quiet, shall we? It's nothing, Parra. One of the cats didn't like me petting it. I'm all right, really. Hmm, yes, well, get what you need from the inn, then, for Garan is desperate for you to be off. And that's just one of the guards patrolling. Okay. Think carefully. What's going on here? We've got a tutor. Hello, child. About weapon quick Shall slots. We continue okay. Your lessons? And Drepin. What do you need? Flidia left one of her books here again. It's in the hay there, beside the cow. If you could run it over to the, her and come back, I've got some plans for you. Okay. There's the book. Let's go and deliver that then, shall we? Get this little quest done. There's Flidia. There we go. Hello there. My book! It, oh, you remind me of Garan when you grin like that. Raising you has been hard on him, I know, but he says it's a toil of love, a toil of destiny even. You must be a very special child indeed to draw such praise from a man of his silent nature. Here, take this little gem of mine. Maybe Winthrop will give you a little something for it. Okay, so we get some experience and we lose the book and we get a lynx eye gem. There we go. That's nice. Let's continue on. Uh, just always keeping an eye out for hidden stashes and things. Another guard. Is he having, and so see, he's he's not I moving. The army. I was in one of the great spires of the keep last night and saw the strangest sight. The horizon was aglow for a time, as though a man. As though many a man carries torches in the distance. Usually there are only merchants on that path, though never at night. Bandits, perhaps, but so many? Mm, interesting. So possibly bandits abroad. Uh, another tutor. Hello, child. Uh, he's talking about Shall temples. Thanks very much. Priest of Ogma. These walls contain the world's knowledge. I am pleased to see you have taken time to pay tribute to wise Ogma. Uh, what do you have here then? So you can donate to the temple. Um, you can get healing for quite a price, to be honest. Uh, you can buy and sell. Can we sell anything here? You won't buy anything of ours, but you can buy healing potions and antidote. And more if we had the gold. And identify items as well. Alright. What else we got? John Delar. Hey yeah. Hey there, Agathis. I see you're up early this day. Well your father Grimes asked me to has asked me a strange favour. Seems he wants you to learn some fighting and asked me to be the teacher. So I hope you brought your staff with you. I do, but I forgot a halberd, and that's a lot better. Hostile creatures have red circles around their feet. Left-clicking within the circle will direct you to attack me. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. During our fight, I'm going to spring a little surprise on you. Remember, you can press the space bar at any time to pause the game. Blah, blah, blah. Are you ready now? Good. Okay, so now we're in a fight. We've got... Eric the Archer and Jondalar's here, so Feel attack my power. Ah, you did good, kid. Especially after Eric started firing those arrows at you. I'm sure your father would be proud. You should go to court, talk to the Gate Warden if you want some experience in fighting with a group of people. You can find him just south of here. Out there, it can be pretty important to know how to fight with allies at your side. Okay, thanks very much, and off they go. Uh, box here. Empty. Reavor. What do you want? Why Moradin's hammer? 
I thought I asked you to clear the rats out of this building yesterday. Hop to it, get in there. Okay. Reaver's storehouse. Uh, our feline forces have turned traitor and the rats are on the rise. Okay, so every good RPG starts with you fighting rats. That's just how it is. So, I think my character can handle this without me doing much. There we go. There we go. Done. Dead. With uh, there's a barrel. With a ring in it. A uh, box. Uh, and another barrel. It's all empty. And there's a couple of cats who obviously haven't been doing their jobs very well. Shame. What do you think, Revo? My Moradin's hammer! Ah, yes, kill them like the rats they are. A glorious battle. Unlike those. Unlike. A glorious battle, unlike any this world has ever seen. Here's five gold pieces. Don't spend it all in one place. Okay. Uh, there's no buildings here, are there? No. There's another tutor. Hello, child. Saving the game. No Shall thanks. It's okay. Your lessons? Hull. Hull, what are you doing? Who are you? Mm. <sighs> hey, kid. I woke late this morning and left my sword in the barracks before going on duty. If you want to get it for me, it's in the chest at the foot of my bed on the right side of the barracks. Quick now, before the gate warden catches me without it. You'll also find an antidote in there. I think Drepper needs one for old Nessa. Okay, Hull needs his sword. We have another tutor. Our rules. Hello, child. Journal. Shall nah, we continue thanks. your lessons? Gate Warden! Soon be gone, will ye? I, Garayan, asked me to teach you a wit about the finer arts of mass combat before you leave. Can it pique your interest in it, Agathis? Uh, sure, Gate Warden, I would appreciate that. Good then, child. Tis one thing to maintain control of yourself in the heat of battle, but tis quite another to maintain one's authority over a group. I've asked O the Illusionist to run ye through a few simulations for ye down in the storage cellars. Just follow me this way and I'll unlock the door for ye. Okay, so he heads down here. For that bit. Um, we might come back and do that in a minute. We have a door here to go through. What's going on here? What's this? Uh, some sort of sleeping courses? I guess there's a priest of Ogma. These walls contain the world's knowledge. So are you sick? You look rather healthy to me, but you never can tell. Do you need any potions or such things? Yes, that would be nice of you. All right then, take this potion. So we've got a healing potion there. That's handy. Uh, there's a locked, a locked desk there, unfortunately. Uh, I don't think we can bash that open. I think we'll be seen if we do that. So let's move on. Think carefully. Um, we'll, come, we'll do that combat in a minute. Hello, child. We have another tutor talking Shall to us about spells. We don't have any spells, unfortunately. Um, let's go and do the the. The, the whole sword thing and everything before we do that combat. Hello, child. Thieving. Shall we continue your lessons? No, I don't need to know about thieving. We have a barrel here and a chest. And free gold in there. Bunkhouse. Okay, let's check out the bunkhouse. I have a blade with your name on oh, it. Oh, here we go. Carbos. You there. You are Gorion's little whelp, aren't you? Yeah, you match the description. You don't look so dangerous to me. And what business is that of yours? I'll make it my business if not I please. I just thought I'd have a look at you for myself before I put a blade down your gullet. Someone seems to think you're trouble, so I'm going to use your head for a ticket out of the gutter. 
Well, I'm just little street trash hood, they say, but I'll show them. And we're in a fight again. Feel my okay. power. He's got a knife. We've got a halberd. Oh. See ya. Yes. Okay, let's take that out. Take his dagger. Nothing in the barrel. Let's move on. Think carefully. Uh, oh, here we go. Something on your mind? Karen. I heard shouting out of this. Are you all right? Um. He, he's dead. Whoever he was, he lunged at me with a knife. Oh, Karen, what is happening to this place? It's not your place, child. It's you thereafter. Garin is waiting on the steps to the central library and wants you to go to him as soon as you've bought what you need at the inn. Oh, Agathis, I have been your tutor for so many years, and only in this moment have I come to doubt that my teachings have been enough. Go to Garin, child. It is safe for you here no longer. Okay, we'll bear that in mind. There's another barrel here. With three gold. Hello, child. Shall we continue okay, um, your business? More tutorials, but that's okay. Another watcher. I can take Drizzt with both my arms tied behind my back. He's talking about the same thing the other guard did. Uh, but this is the barracks. Okay, this is where Hull's sword should be. With caution. Who are you? Fuller. I should have joined the army. Oh, what a mead-filled knight. That Hull's just too much. Poor Sapper to go man the gate this morning too. I don't know how he does it. What could I do for you anyways? Um, yeah, the mead will explain why Hull forgot to put his sword on this morning. He sent me to fetch it for him. Sure, sure. It should be over in the chest over there, against the right wall there. I should have joined the army. Um, oh, we can talk to him again. I was just wondering if you had any errands I could run. Errands? Yeah, actually. I need a quarrel of crossbow bolts. If you could get some off Winthrop at the inn, I'd reimburse you. Oh, very well. There'll be a few coins in it for you too. Jesus, Scott, stop giving me that look. So, Fuller is recovering from last night's mead fest <laughs> at the barracks and he wants crossbow bolts. Luckily, we bought some earlier. I should have joined the army. Thanks, kid. I hear tell you might be leaving this place soon. Watch your back out there, okay? Here, let me give you this dagger. My father killed a goblin with it once, many years ago. Stabbed him right in the back he did. It ain't no broadsword, but it'll do in a pinch. Now take care of yourself. So, we lost our bolts, we gained some experience, and we gained a dagger. And it looks like it's some sort of enchanted dagger as well, because it's blue. It's a dagger plus one. There we go. Um, it just makes it slightly easier to hit and does slightly more damage. So, where's Fuller's sword then? There's his sword and there's an antidote. And I guess we can't open any of these because it will be... They're locked and will be seen. Okay, we're not a thief type, we're not going to just take everything. Think carefully. But would, I'm, I'm sure there is a way I could cheese through it and... Um, find a way to make the guards not see, but we're not going to... We're not going to metagain this to death, I don't think. So that's us done. Didn't we have anything else in our journal? Um, oh, whole sword and firebeard scroll, okay. Um, we're back at the inn. Can we sell any of our stuff? Just get rid of some of the junk, perhaps? Yes. My hotel's as clean as an elven arse. Can we sell off some junk, perhaps? Let's sell off the single dagger. And these extra daggers. And the warhammer for one coin each. And this dagger. Um, we'll keep the plus one dagger, and the silver necklace, and the lynx eye gem. 
I guess. Um, and we keep Hull's sword, of course, because we're going to need that. Uh, I think I might just wear these. I like... I got myself a bit of jewellery. A bit of flash, yeah? I'm entitled to be, wear a little bit of flash now and then. I can always put this quarterstaff here, just in case that breaks. Just to put the dagger there. And hold sword I'm about to give out. Um, I'll equip the healing potion in case I need that. And I think I have to do something with this antidote. But I think we will call that an episode. I'm going to keep these episodes pretty short. Um, and I'll issue them out. I'll upload them to YouTube as often as possible during the playthrough. So thanks very much for watching this one. Uh, we'll see what happens with the other quest items in the next episode. So, my name is Agathis. Thanks very much for watching this video. Please remember to consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already done so. And leave a comment and a like down below so I need to know your thoughts on the subject. Any advice is appreciated. I'm going offline and you will see me for more Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition next time.